I'm really looking forward to interviewing David Zervos. David and I catch up in various places around the world, and what's so fascinating about him, he has an insider's view of the Fed, he has a very different view to many of the people in the macro world, he doesn't mind being out of consensus, and he's been dead right for a long time. He's a really smart thinker, and I think we're really going to enjoy what he's got to say. Uh, one of the reasons I'm focused on dollar yen is actually my long-term Japanese story, which is that um, ultimately the Japanese will burn all of their debt. What do I mean by burn all of their debt? Right now, the BOJ owns about 40% of the entire stock of outstanding JGBs. So they have a 250% debt to GDP ratio, but really there's only about 150% of GDP sloshing around in the market. They're buying a pretty good clip of this stuff every month. Japan is not going to get any inflation out of this. They have a demographic storyline which is very disinflationary and exceedingly disinflationary 10 years down the road. My guess is if we fast forward three, four, five years, the BOJ is going to find itself in a position where it owns 70% mm -hmm. of the entire JGB market, maybe more. Especially if we get this directed flow into the US. And they could even do a deal with Trump where they say, let dollar yen go higher, we'll buy your bonds and make sure your rates don't go up, which they've tried to do twice. They tried to do that right after the election, and they tried to do that during the taper tantrum. Specific fund, issue yen, buy dollar stuff, just don't call us a manipulator. That's a great trade for Japan and a great trade for the US. And it keeps your bond yields in check, which I think ultimately they don't have. They go up, but they don't go up that much. Yeah. But let's just say you wake up one day and the BOJ has 75-80% of all the outstanding government bonds. There's no inflation. There's a little ceremony out on the uh, Imperial Palace grounds. Minister of Finance, you know, dressed in his full regalia of kimono and, and samurai sword and, and Bank of Japan governor facing him in the same outfit and they, they bow to each other and shake hands and it's announced that um, the Ministry of Finance does not owe the Bank of Japan any funds for the repayment of the bonds that it's purchased. 